This morning. is the day the Lord has made. Let us rejoice and be glad in it. I'm Pastor Marianne Kalmbach, pastor at Living Faith Church, which is located in the master planned community that's called Tradition in the city of Port St. Lucie in the state of Florida. We have a birthday boy today. Oh. Now, now, when Rick was in church yesterday, he said, I said, happy early birthday. He said, yeah, please don't announce it. I said, no, it's not a Sunday. <laughs> Only if your birthday falls on a Sunday. But since your birthday fell on a Monday. I'm glad your wife can keep secrets. <laughs> Let us sing. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Rick. Happy birthday to you and many more. Happy birthday. That was very kind of you. Happy birthday, happy birthday. Yes. Oh my gosh. So today is, Rick, would you like to tell us what day it is? Monday, April the 15th. Tax day, and I think it's also Patriots Day in Mass, right? Yeah, so today they run in the Boston Marathon, and my niece is running in the Boston Marathon. She qualified this year, which is exciting, very exciting. My niece, yeah. So um, it is our Faith and Fitness Monday. As you can see, it's quite the lively group here. Um, <laughs> <laughs> our um, faith portion of our Faith and Fitness Day, our devotion is from Jesus Always, Sarah Young. Even the birds are getting into it. Love it, but they always do. Now, I want you to close your eyes as you're able. And I want you to imagine that this is Jesus talking to you. You are troubled by fear of failure, but my love for you will never fail. Let me describe what I see as I gaze at you, beloved. You look regal, for I have clothed you in my righteousness and crowned you with glory and honor. You are radiant, especially when you are looking at me. You are beautiful as you reflect my glory back to me. In fact, you delight me so much that I rejoice over you with shouts of joy. This is how you appear through my grace-filled vision. Because I am infinite, I can see you as you are now and as you will be in heaven simultaneously. Viewing you in the present, I work with you on things you need to change. Seeing you from the heavenly perspective, I love you as if you were already perfect. I want you to learn to love yourself and look at yourself and others through the lens of my unfailing love. As you persevere in this, you will gradually find it easier to love yourself and others. I invite you to open your eyes. I hope that you saw that vision. I hope you saw yourself as our Lord sees you because that's how I see you. The more we spend in bathing ourselves in the word of the Lord, we begin not only to reflect it, but also we begin to um, see it in others. So I want you to remember this vision that you saw, the radiance, the love, the beauty, um, peace. There's a peace that's in there also. I want you to not only, when you look in the mirror, see yourself in that way, I want you to truly begin to believe it because you are made in the image of our Lord. And in this Easter season, that is what we remember, that gift that we have been given. So go out there and live into the creation that you already are. Let us pray. Good and gracious Lord God, on this day, you remind us of how you see us. Help us, gracious Lord God, to be able to look in the mirror and see ourselves as you see us. And then, through your Holy Spirit, help us to live into that, to be that, 
that radiance to be your love in the world. And help us, gracious Lord God, to have the eyes as you see the other, that we may see each and every person in that same glorious and radiant life. We pray this in the name of your Son, Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. And now we pray those words that Jesus taught us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. Oh my gosh, these birds are just singing and fluttering. And oh, take that. Take the image of your radiant self with you. And that nature sings the glory of God on this day. See you back here next Monday. Blessings. Bye.